this is pretty cool, as is the place I'm in. I'm in Paris at the Louvre Art Museum with Samsung, where they're launching their brand new 2017 QLED TVs, and they look incredible. Now, the reason I'm sat in this slightly peculiar and very uncomfortable chair is because basically you can put this TV anywhere you want. Samsung's designed this set as a bit of a designer set, a mock living room, because the QLEDs basically can fit in anywhere. They've got super thin bezels, a brand new no gap wall mount, so you can put this on your wall and there'll be no space between it, which is fantastic. Basically, you can put it anywhere and it will look great. But it's not just about where you can place it. There are other issues too, like cables. And that's why they've introduced a new invisible cable, which connects to their One Connect box. So you have one almost invisible cable that comes from the box where you've got your games consoles, your Xbox, your PS4, your Blu-ray player plugged in, and then that goes up to the back of the TV. You can barely see it, which means if you are putting this on the wall, there's no ugly cables in sight. And it also means you can hide all your consoles and players away from the TV to give you a nice decluttered, beautiful modern home. Now let's talk about picture quality. The Q in QLED stands for Quantum Dot, which is their new technology which can produce up to 2,000 nits on some of these TVs, which is insane. Now you might be thinking, why do I want my TV that bright? I don't want it to sear my corneas when I'm watching it in bed or in my living room. That's fair. But what it does do is it allows a much wider range of colors, or as Samsung are calling it, an improved color volume. So you may not have 2,000 nits of pure white, but what it allows is the blues, the reds, the greens to really feel vibrant and rich no matter what the scene, light or dark. And the reason you'd want better color volume, which is not something other manufacturers are really talking about, is because the eye, the human eye, can see a lot more than current TV technology can actually show you. This unlocks that. And other TVs, even if they're 4K and HDR, simply can't match the QLEDs for the pure brightness and that great color volume. But not only do these TVs look great, they're incredibly smart as well. These are the smartest TVs Samsung's ever produced. You've got Samsung's brand new One Remote Control, which can control all your games consoles, Blu-ray players, and set-top boxes. And it also supports voice control, so you can tell it to change the import or go to a particular channel. Not only that, but we've got an enhanced smart hub, a whole new unified experience, which makes it really easy to navigate apps for streaming, listening to music, and watching movies. There's also a brand new app for your phone, which lets you control everything you could possibly want. So there's loads of great features to talk about with these new QLED TVs. And to be honest, I'm most impressed by the Quantum Dock technology. The pictures look fantastic. And honestly, the technical side of things kind of goes over my head a little bit. I had to be explained what color volume was a couple of times. But really, in real life, it just translates to beautiful images. Super bright, super vibrant, really, really colorful. And it's not just, as I say, about picture quality, the style here at the Louvre, this will sit and fit in any living room. It looks absolutely stunning. That is a very cute dog. It's so refreshing that Samsung are not only delivering excellent picture quality, but really, you know, focusing on other things like smarts, like the style and the design. So honestly, I'm incredibly excited for these new TVs. They look fantastic. You can get rid of all your cables and your ugly boxes. This can be the centerpiece of your brand new futuristic modern looking living room and I really like that. So Samsung are launching their brand new QLED TVs here in Paris today and they should be shipping in the UK around April time. So stay tuned for more from me and from QLED and from Samsung very soon. Thanks for watching.